if I really talk about this, but I like perfumes. I like smelling good. Um, and I kept seeing this brand pop up all over TikTok. Um, and I saw that they came out with a mini version. It's like a little mini rollerball. Yara, it's the pink one. Yeah, a little lower. And then like without even touching it, it does smell really good. Um, definitely getting like vanilla and coconut and all of that. It does have like a slight sweet undertone. And I know people said, I think like strawberries or something. Um, it does appear to be leaking a little bit. You can kind of see it like on the bottle, how it like is discolored, but like I can kind of get the strawberry scent. It almost reminds me of like suntan lotion and then like some sort of like vanilla sweet scent, but it's light, it's good. Um, I mean, it's nothing to rave about, but it's like a nice summer scent. And I like more muskier scents, so I'm not, and I'm not mad at this. Like I would wear this, so. Okay, bye. I really wanted to come on here because I was influenced by TikTok and I got this like car diffuser thing. I already opened it, but I haven't smelled it yet. So I took the little stopper out. You're supposed to like tip it over for one, two, oh, there we go. So see how it's like getting filled. Anyway, it smells nice, it's subtle. So we'll see if that um, does anything. I'm just gonna tie it and then hang it on my mirror. Nothing fancy. Okay, it's hanging. <laughs> also, also, I have like another chapstick to leave in here. And then I got two other scents. People are probably like, what the fuck is she doing in her car? Um, I got bourbon vanilla and I got midnight ice. It's supposed to smell like the ice scent for like the, those trees. And my dad likes that, so got that one for him. Other than that, that's it. <laughs> That's all the fun um, updates I have. I'm gonna go to the gym right now. And I'm nervous, I don't know why, but it'll go away I think once I get there. So, see you at the gym. Hey friends, I just got out of the Zumba. Actually, not really. <laughs> I went and got coffee. And now I'm heading to my parents because my mom had to get an MRI like a couple weeks ago and you have to take off all your jewelry when you get an MRI done and she had one of those like permanent bracelets so she had to cut it and the lady that did it was like oh if you cut it and you you know hold on to it then I'll be able to put it back on for you and so my mom was like hey do you want to go with me to get that done today so I'm currently heading there to meet her after her hair appointment so that we can go do permanent jewelry. Uh, I think I might get an, uh, like another anklet because I have too many bracelets at the moment. Um, and this lady in particular, I've gotten an anklet from her already and it's really cute, but I think it needs a little extra something. So I'm gonna do that. Um, and yeah, we're just gonna have a cute little Saturday. So that's all. Okay, bye. Hi, Pooper. Hi. Are you happy? The pupper. This is mod. <laughs> oh, the will is. You're so cute. Look at this cute pupper. You're too far. Come here. Pupper. Okay. Hi friends. 
so I have some things that I want to show you that I got. First things first, I finally have a lampshade for it. <laughs> uh, it was a bit of a puzzle, I guess you could say. Um, we, I like ordered the wrong attachment for the shade, and so it wasn't like fitting on the base of the, the stand. And then I had to get a different one, so now it works and it looks really cute. It is a like a grayish shade color, so um, I don't know if it doesn't look like it really, but I don't know. I like it. I don't mind it. The next thing that I got was this like jewelry like ring cleaner pen because I wear a lot of rings and uh, I don't really clean them that often, which I probably should. And I saw this. I think it's like a brush on this side. And then I think you twist it. And it's supposed to come out. Oh yeah, see? It's coming out. And I have this ring that I wear a lot. This one. So here's a before. I don't know if it'll focus. Brush it on, and then you, do you rinse it off? I guess it doesn't say, does it? Oh yeah, so you wet the brush. Oops. <laughs> oh yeah, it's like soap. <laughs> so it's easy. How nifty. And then you rinse it off. And we'll do this one too, just for the heck of it. Some blue stuff. I notice a difference, I don't know if you will, but I'm thoroughly impressed. It is so much shinier. I'll try and play like the clip side by side. Because my skin is already like really pigmented and um, has a lot of texture, I didn't want to do too much. But I think you just put it on overnight and it's really supposed to help with skin texture. Yeah, refines rough skin and dead skin cells to make natural smooth skin. Um, use at the first step of daily skin care. So I've seen befores and afters of people and it's it really does a good job. I'm like really impressed by this. <laughs> like I, I hope you can see the difference. Um, so I will be trying this in a separate video, probably like a YouTube short. Um, so, you know, reviews for that to come. And then the second thing I got, product wise, I had a sample of this from my sister. And I ended up really liking it because sometimes my skin gets really like oily with all of the different products I've been using. Because um, I've been using serums and then moisturizers and all of that. But the product that I really liked was the Shiseido uh, Hydrating Cream. And it has like hyaluronic acid. So I got the full size. Oh, and it comes with a little, a little like scoop. But this is her. So trippy. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to use this. So those are like the two beauty products I got off Amazon. And then other things that I got that were not from Amazon, um, I got a touch order. So I'm gonna open that because I got some freebies that I wanna kind of take a look at with you guys. I think these are the free samples. Yeah. So I got their silk sunscreen as a sample and then they just came out with these lip tints uh, 
so I got plum blossom. I'm not sure which one it is on here, but it's like a, it's the red, one of the reddish ones. So it's like this. A little uh, orangey for my skin tone, but it's okay. I'm pretty sure it's this top one here. It looks pinker, I think, on the website, so whatever. We'll try that at some point. I've been seeing a lot of peeling on my forehead, and I will either use like an exfoliating mitt to get it off but I feel like that doesn't really last very long or I would use um, like a sugar scrub but that doesn't really seem to do the job either so I got the gentle rice polish I'll show you what it looks like for those who haven't bought it before it's in the purple jar it looks like this and it has it's basically like little beads uh, and then they kind of dissolve a little bit in the it's like a really gentle exfoliant, but for something a little more intense, I really like their rice wash, so I got the really big size, um, and I'm gonna use that later today because I need it. And there's like, honestly, I tried like a knockoff of this, and it just doesn't compare. Like, I like the grittiness of it, and it's not too harsh, but it gets the job done, so I was like, I'm just gonna buy it on online. And then the last thing I got, which I wanted to try because I don't like washing, like full on washing my face. Like sometimes it just needs extra moisture. And then, so I'll put on like a serum and then a moisturizer, but I've heard that serums go onto the skin well when it's wet. So I'm gonna try their Luminous Dewy Skin Mist and then put the serum on. scent but that's okay yeah that's my little haul for now that was definitely overdue because i was waiting for lent to be over which i'm glad it is <laughs> so that's all see you later bye